All right, in today's tutorial, we're going to be looking at how to put a letter and a background or letterhead or stationary, I guess you could say, together so that when we print them, they all print at one time. So I got this project in the other day. Uh, in fact, if you watched my tutorial yesterday or whatever, my tutorial on how to uh, create this letter using a mail merge. So we've got all these different letters and uh, we used a mail merge inside of uh, Microsoft Publisher. Well, I saved it down to a PDF because that's how we require people to send us print jobs is to send them as PDFs. Well, there was a department on campus. They sent me their letter. They sent me some letterhead. They said, please print the letterhead and then print the letter onto the letterhead. Well, that's printing twice, costs twice as much. And so I said, there's got to be a way to get the letterhead and this together. And there is. So let's go ahead and close out the letterhead for now. We're going to go ahead and just open up the letter. And we're going to expand over here. Okay, now we've got um, Acrobat Reader is what's open right now. I need to close that. I just realized that. And we need to go into our project files here. Uh, you have to have Acrobat Pro in order to do what I'm about to show you. So you need to be able to open your PDF in Acrobat Pro. So to do that, I'm going to right click on a PDF and I'm going to say open with Acrobat. There we go. Okay, this is looking much better. All right, now we're going to go up to Tools. This is real simple. Tools and make sure you're on the Pages tab. So if that's not scrolled down, just tap it, scroll it down, click on Background. You click that, say add a background, and here it's going to let us um, pick a specific file or you can even choose from a color. We want to choose a specific file, so I'm going to say browse, and I had already looked at one before, but I don't want to look at it in that, in that folder. Uh, it's going to be over here, and there we go, there's the letterhead. We open it up, that's what it's going to look like. I'm going to say apply to multiple because we've got 20 pages here, uh, but you can add different ones, uh, different files to different pages if you want to. Uh, I'm just adding it to all of them because I'm using the same letterhead for all of the letters. So I say apply to multiple. It says that it's ready. I say OK. Uh, it asks me where I want to put it the output options. I'm just going to say don't save changes. Uh, it'll just open when it's finished and then I can save the file somewhere else if I want to. So I'm going to go ahead and say OK. Give it a couple of seconds and BAM! The letter and the letterhead are now all inside of one file. Look at that. Now I just print and fold and we're good to go. It's really that simple, but you do need Acrobat Pro in order to do what I just showed you how to do. Just to be sure, I'm going to say no on that. Let's go ahead and open this. And yeah, there's nothing inside of Adobe Reader that's going to allow us to add a background <clears throat> that I know of. Uh, I don't see anything here. I'll keep looking, but I'm pretty sure you need Acrobat Pro. All right, that's it for today. Catch you in the next tutorial. If you have not already subscribed to the channel, please do so. And I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.